received the worst news ever may 7th 2008 we just got out of an ultrasound we're waiting for the doctor to come give us good news about our new son he comes in kind of head down he said your son has hydrocephalus which water crushed his brain he has zero percent chance to live we should abort him we ended up crying we ended up scream crying yelling crying it was the worst emotional day of my life but watch how faithful our god is God's the great physician, not the doctor. He decides how long Andrew's gonna live or die. And so Andrew ended up living for 14 incredible, amazing, memorable years. And if you guys know his story, he ended up passing away last year on 7-1 of 2022. But it's okay because now he's resting in the arms of the Almighty. But look back what I saw for the hope and numbers for that day. If it's your birthday today, happy birthday. Or if this is a reason it could be special for you, listen to this. 5-7 connects with 1 Peter 5-7. It says, cast all your anxiety on God for he cares for you. That's exactly what he did. He cared for us. He let him live and have 14 incredible years. Drop down. God will supply all of our needs in the comments if you believe this. Share this and follow us if you want to hear more stories about this and others of thousands of stories how faithful our God has been through the numbers. And I thank God for every day I had with him. Today is super special to me. Cast all your cares on God. Cash that fire. Bye.